Yeah, you, you put that in my head, dude. I'm gonna have to hurt you. <laughs> totally lost track of what I was gonna do. Oh yeah, I was picking up this Demeter. We need to get out of the sector, though, so it can park sometime this year. Oh, yeah, I do. It was a great show. It was, you know, it was Jim Henson's uh, creature shop. Of course it was a good show. The dude couldn't make a bad kid show. It, it was just not possible. <laughs> That, and uh, if you ever saw Boondock Saints, the movie, um, what is it? The guy, <laughs> the guy who plays, uh, the only human character in Fraggle Rock, the guy that owns the dog, uh, uh, he plays the barkeeper, the owner of the bar where the Russians come in and try to shut down right at the start of the movie that starts the whole thing. The guy with Tourette's. Shit! Fuck! Arse! He starts cursing like in the hospital in front of a bunch of nuns. It's just fucking great. It's like, wow! You, you don't expect those words to come out of that guy. Because he's like, he's such a nice person in the in the 80s when Fraggle Rock was on. And now he's got Tourette's and curses like a sailor. <clears throat> okay, enough pontificating. <clears throat> Ooh, looks like there could be a fight here. <clears throat> it depends on how the parent are feeling about the pirates today. Oh, Dark Crystal was way ahead of its time, yeah. Fizz gig. Oh. I had a I had a chinchilla named Fizz gig. He had seizures and he died from them. It was sad. He was a good little good little critter though. He um my ex-wife picked him out. And he would uh jump down her shirt and turn back around, jump up, and perch between her boobs. It was just adorable. Very snuggly for a chinchilla. They're not usually the most cuddly uh, rodents, but they're... I mean, they're friendly. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dark Crystal's very, very good. Agra, wasn't that the name of the old psycho witch type character? I love it. We're, we're, I'm sitting here playing a game and we're reminiscing about old movies. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, Labyrinth too. Man, the music in Labyrinth was amazing. Of course, it was David Bowie, so of course it was good. <clears throat> I had, I had that soundtrack on at work like 10, 15 years ago. It's at, one, at an office building I worked in. And the end theme that has a, a good, really strong, loud chorus singing backup vocals, uh, you know, that was cranking. It's just a good tune. And one of my coworkers, honestly, they knew I'm an atheist and honestly asked me, is that gospel music you're listening to? Like, um, what? That's fucking David Bowie, you asshole. That, that one cracked me up. Man, there is just no military response to any of these. That's disappointing. Hmm. 
Nothing there either. God damn. Go for it, Sammy. Hey, I'm going to have to go pick a fight with somebody. There's nothing else to do. <laughs> Where was it? Grand Exchange. Yeah, we're going to go play over there. <laughs> yep. There's no army. I can fix that. Oh, yeah, I think we're going to jump in on this action. There's enough backup there for me to have fun without getting killed too hard. You know, it's funny you mentioned that, Sammy. The, the player is actually a separate faction in the game. Grand exchange. At least uh, per the game code. I don't think it's possible, even in Lit Cubes, to own your own sectors, though. You... You can in the base game. Albion Prelude actually gave you the ability to do that. Oh, shit. Well, then. Let's see if I can take out a P. Oh, shit. He's got backup. He's got backup. The answer is no, I cannot. <clears throat> and of course I'm showing him my ass. God damn it. Suck my knob, asshole! Oh yeah, I can I can jump in there. I'm not gonna get in any trouble, isn't it? Fuckers pinched me in. <clears throat> Alright, man, take care. Good luck with your move. Hope it goes well. Because moves really suck when they don't. <laughs> we'll hold down the fort for you. <laughs> I thought they were coming for me for a minute there. <laughs> Alright, my shield should be regened enough. Dive back into this fight. Once I get to it. is now in firing range. The Talati Company are grateful for your timely help. Who put that there? Much profit as a reward, you get one thousand credits. Xenon M. I uh, hear Rugen being an asshole out in the living room. He wants to go outside. He's got a nice little scab slash wound on his cheek that needs to heal before I let him outside again. This displeases him, so he is being a complete dick. And I'm not kidding. He'll get up on, on your desk, walk around, stomp around for a couple seconds... Jump down as noisily as he can, pounds his feet, like stomps his feet. Ooh, an M. Hey, Maggie. Buggy, I don't think she wants you to sniff her ass. It's kind of the vibe I'm getting.
Hornet missile. Xenon end. Oh, I can go in, actually. I kind of want to see them take out the P... Oh, he's already gone. Okay. <laughs> well, then. M. I guess we'll go get that M. And now Maggie is back to her... Give me, a, give me attention! Self. She's going to start rubbing the uh, mic here in a minute. <laughs> See, that one's perfect. That one's just perfect. Who the fuck is shooting at me? You motherfucker. Cut it out. Company are grateful for your timely help in the saving of much profit. As a reward, you get 500 credits. Oops. Turning to face the enemy might be a good idea. Ha, ah, you missed. I'm gonna have to refill on chaff soon. Oh god! Oops. Quit spamming the fucking missiles, you whore! Christ. Hey, Maggie. Oh shit, out of chaff. Fucker. M. <clears throat> I love seeing random missiles streak by like minutes after the or thirty seconds after the fight's over. <laughs> Yoink! Where are we? <laughs> Just want to make sure someone doesn't jump in and surprise make my day miserable. <sighs> well, that was an entertaining fight. An M entertaining fight, I mean. Crazy cat, what you doing? Perch on that mouse pad, I'm going to put you on the floor Starburst. again. Starburst. M. Docking granted. Woohoo! <laughs> going to keep the M. That's a unique ship type. I don't think I have any of those. Nope, just that one. Hey, he's not mining. Oh. <laughs> That's because he picked thing Ooh, he picked up some stuff. Jesus. Okay, that that was kind of fast. I didn't expect that. You know, if uh, if those don't sell for much, I'm gonna sell this ship because it's it's a discoverer that can shoot mining lasers, but it can hold three things.
Eh, stupid chair. All right, to uh, readjust myself, make sure all the dangly unmentionables are in the right place. <clears throat> oh, fuel status, bone dry. And I'm just casually backing up into whatever. Hmm. I want to bother with this Harrier. What? Oh. Harrier. Yeah, what the hell. Because <laughs> it's right by that jump gate of happiness. It leads to the sector of joy and the bringers of fun that live there. Why is the gate lighting up? Why is the gate lighting up? Oh, someone else is flying through it. Okay. Like, uh... This is a bad place to get caught with your pants down. Namely, in a spacesuit. I'm gonna save, just in case. Harrier. You know, I really don't get many viewers anymore. <laughs> I just looked up and I've got five. One of them's a bot. <laughs> Ship computer control transferred. Yeah. It's not about the numbers, it's about having fun with it. Xenon sector five nine eight. No, I want it. Give me my ship. Oh. Starburst. Harrier. You can go straight to the shipyard. Docking granted. Boing. Command accepted. I'm going the opposite direction of that gate. Ooh, excuse me, again. Now, you see that? There's a fucking Titan coming into that system. There should be a, a bloody battle of doom going on there, but there just isn't. Mist of Elysium? What's going on there? No. Yeah, this is weird. I'm, I'm not used to seeing the game running like this where just pirates run completely rampant and nobody fights back. It's just weird. Hmm. Well, make your own action, I guess, and find a Pelotian space equipment dog. Successfully docked. Juice me up, baby. <clears throat> Let us computer station. Huh, only 35 mil for that. For a six. Oh, hold on. It's less than that, actually. <laughs> I love it with the higher sun input 
it's actually more expensive to build a station. A complex that turns out shields. And it doesn't improve the production rate either. What if I do a 10? Oh, yeah. Blech. Beep, boop, boop, boop. Fifty million for that. Seventy-two shields an hour. <clears throat> Decent energy cell surplus, too. Oh, I might just have to do that. I thought I had more stock than that. Whatever. Well, I can afford that whenever I'm ready. Wow, that hauler is still parking. All this screwing around, and it's still trying to land. Oh, no, no, it just landed. That's, that's kind of funny. Navigation command software MK1 special command software and trading trade command software and triplex scan <clears throat> installed. I think that's all he needs except for a home base assignment. Oh no, a tractor beam. Or transporter device rather. Uh oh. Sounds like Rugen's coughing. So it was really unnerving when a cat starts coughing on something. Not a hairball, but just trying to clear a windpipe. Poor guy. Who sells transporters? Pretty sure. Homie of Light. Where the fuck is he? Oh, yeah, home of light, definitely. Yay! I remembered. Go me. Docking granted. Command accepted. Shuttle, let us use the Demeter Hauler. Uh, oh, good, it remembered. Yay! <laughs> Slaves in high demand. No, oh, everybody hates ore. That's weird. It doesn't show shields on this list.
Yeah, anyway. How about my discoverer? <laughs> He's still parking. At least he's in the right system. Yeah, he's still lumbering his way over there. Ugh, shit takes forever. Come on, game. Something to do. <laughs> He's still gate camping that fucking thing. <laughs> or, or camping, anyway. That is a stubborn Xenon chip. Yeah, it does look like a razor, doesn't it? <clears throat> Eighteen billion. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> we gotta sus we gotta pause this for a second. You guys gotta see this. Ah! Here we go. Assuming the cable will reach. Oh, I'll just go under. Why not? Of course that didn't work. Watch me tangle my shit. Yeah. Do this before she gets out. Yes, I'm making you look at my cat. Uh, let's hang this down there. So, my room's a mess, of course. There, you see her? Oh, shit. Hang on, let's move this. There. Hang on. Bella? Bella? Hey, kitty kitty! Look up at me. Come here. She's in that bottom drawer. I can't get her to look now that, of course, I've got a camera on it. Bella! Come here. She managed to squeeze through that tiny gap. It's open like two inches, by the way. Bella! There. Not sure if you can see her eyes, but there she is. Freaking weird. These are the animals I live with that I'm, you know, expected to sleep around without being afraid of dying. This is all you're going to do, isn't it? It's going to be forever before she actually gets out. Blech. So, yeah, that's a very shaky cam version of what my office looks like. I guarantee you she's going to climb out and do something really cute here in a minute. Hi. Naturally, the minute I sit down... And put the camera away. She pops her head up. I'm like, what? Okay, I'm over it. Sorry, guys. It was a silly interlude, but whatever. My stream, I show what I want. <laughs> Why don't I have any viewers? Because you only talk about fucking cats, man.
Maybe I should go after the Phenom Corporation a little bit. Nova. Trouble is, I can't kill their uh, tankers before they jump, and then they just throw a bunch of stupid drones at me. Hmm. What's going on in Rolk's fate? I think she thinks she's stuck. Hold on. <laughs> Hello, baby. You having fun? Are you okay? There. <clears throat> now she can get out. Eleanor's fortune. There we go. Oh, now that should be a good fight. Jump device charging at ten percent. Thirty. Forty. Fifty percent. Sixty. Seventy. <laughs> She's not even remotely panicked, either. She's perfectly content and happy with herself for figuring out how to get in there. I'm curious how the hell she did get in there, but whatever. Entering system, Elena's fortune. Cats, Will. Don't talk about cats all the goddamn time. Also, bleh. No aim. Oh. Argon, task force, command, Atlas. Oh, that's, that's a big fight going here. Boom! Right in the belly. Pow! Right in the kisser. Okay, no one near us. Boom! My god, that's a big ship! Look at that Atlas! It is absolutely molesting this Carrick, too. You picked the wrong day to jump through that gate, huh? That was a bit of an epic shot right there. Now what we've got here is a fancy little ship. Oh, we lost somebody. And oh yeah, yeah, I know. <clears throat> the lighting in this sector is terrible. I want to see that ship lit up. Good lighting. It's gonna wipe the walls with everything left. There's, there's just no good angle to see this thing.
<laughs> yeah, it, it kind of does, actually. I hate you guys! The South Park reference. I'm terrible. Can't do a Cartman impression. <laughs> Poor guy's trying to turn, too, and he's just... Getting outmaneuvered by whatever's behind him. Because, you know, it's it's not a tank. Floating city. What is on his ass, anyway? Oh, he is taking hits. Okay. Oh, you're dead. Thank you for playing. Light shield pirate Barracuda. Oh God. <laughs> hey, free Barracuda. <laughs> I'll take it. That's the only bail we got, too. Sigh. Ooh, something big in Getsufune. Oh, no, a bunch of little things. Grr. Where's it counting two ships or two enemies? You're drunk, game. This is like when you're hungry and nothing sounds good. Got a full menu of things to play with and or look at and order and then it just it all sort of falls down. I think we'll salvage this and uh, finish up the uh, fuel ship. I'm tired of having to park to get gas. Gas should come to me. Because reasons and stuff. <laughs> Barracuda. I don't think Zero K requires steam. Ship computer Not even sure it's on steam. Barracuda is an M3? Huh. Oh, yeah. I'm just saying, what do you need steam for? <laughs> Sorry. It's a good game, though. I can think of worse things to get hooked on. I mean, the, the developers alone, they're just nuts with how fast they update that thing. Almost every day a new patch comes out, and it, it's not just bug fixes. They actually are adding stuff all the time. Barracuda. I don't want a barracuda. Get that to the shipyard. I go sell it. Turn it into money, please. <clears throat> oh, 
Okay. Oh yay! So he needs a transporter. There we go. Quantum jump gate extension. That's what I wanted. Explorer command software installed. Oh, that's why that thing didn't work when I hooked it up on another ship. You have to have jump cores. I'm an idiot. Okay, so the... Loot whore is ready, I believe. Or, sorry, the... Uh... Fuel ship. Let's send him home. Oh. Wrong buttons! Command accepted. Why do I send him home? Send him here. Give me get. Oh, no, I don't want him doing that. He'll come through that gate. Command accepted. Energy cells. What? Oh. Autopilot off. I have to configure my ship. Hold on, what? That's horse shit. Resupply me for all the jumps. <laughs> Command accepted. Energy cells. Resupply full. Fueling not required. I'm not full, you asshat. Oh, it's because I've got something targeted. Rhyme spaced. And Command accepted. Energy cells. There we go. <clears throat> you can't have an active target that you own that needs no fuel. Jump to me, baby. Put the fuel in my belly. <laughs> Should be right around here. <sighs> where's the loot shuttle? Or where's the gas shuttle? Whatever. It's, uh... I think it's an idiot. It, it's even set to auto-jump. It has more than enough fuel. Uh, what in hell are you doing? Oh, it's landing at the station to get fuel. Okay, derp, that's fine. I can tolerate that. Jumping! Yay! Appear before me, mighty ship! Transferred. Yay! Command accepted. Now fuck off! <laughs> I'm almost manic, aren't I? Or bipolar. <clears throat> Whoa! There's a sector I haven't even seen? I guess whatever south of... Balaji's joy. Omakaslat's treaty. Right, let's go play there. 
<laughs> this will be safe, fun, and easy for the whole family. Uh, so my uh, uh, my wife works tomorrow, really long shift. Um, so I'm probably going to stream tomorrow a bit too. With a little luck, my voice will be better. <clears throat> Running out of steam today, as far as voice goes. So probably not going to do this for too much longer. So. Jumpy gate. <laughs> Mm, come on now. Blah. You have gained recognition. The hell did I do? Friend of the split. I'll take it. What do we got? Special Weapons Production Complex. What do you sell? A whopping two things that are fucking generic. Lovely. Wrong button. Right button. Wait, what? God damn it. And me without any chaff. Well, I might be fucked. Can I jump to that gate yet? Oh, neat. The whole sector is moving toward me. This is going to be great. Just get the damn thing on the map and I'll jump out of here. Oh, boy. A Polaka. There's a carrier. <laughs> There's that fucking gate. Self-destructed. Jump device charging at 10 <laughs> 20. Go that way! 40. 50%. 60. 70. 80. 90. <clears throat> jumping. Bye bye! Bleh. system, Elena's fortune. Yay, I filled out the little gap on my map. <laughs> I should go see what's going on in the, uh... I haven't been down there in a while, actually. Let's do that. Let's piss off the Xenon and the pirates all at the same time. The Pelius! Bleh. Oops. Premature bleh. Bleh. Holy shit. Nothing actually landed on my face when I jumped out of there. That's a rarity. New sector on map. Entering system. Xenon sector 101. Ha! <laughs> Bye-bye. Bleh. Entering system. Nopilios's memorial. Xenon LS. Well, I might actually be able to win some friends and influence people. Pick on enough of these Xenon bastards. If you kill Xenon in pirate territory, pirates like you more. In theory. Of course, it's a big swarm of Xenon. <clears throat> yeah. Theory being the operative word here. Uh, 
At least they haven't started spamming missiles at me yet. Target is now in firing range. Just a little closer. That'll do. Hi, fucker. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That doesn't sound good. All right, we'll take on the LX first. Why the hell not? 32%. 15 per old dime dead. <laughs> I'm going to try that one more time, and I think we'll call it quits. You know, I should probably just rearm and get some missiles. But where's the fun in that? My mistake was I didn't shoot fast and early enough. <laughs> I don't have the brain power to go compare all the missile types again and pick the right one for the task. I'm just going to shoot this asshole. And, oof, there go my shields. Yeah. So that was a stupid idea. We all knew it was coming. All right, guys, I'm exhausted. At least my voice is. So I'm going to bail. Thanks for watching today. Uh, tune in tomorrow. I will probably stream some more. Um, probably more X3 because I'm kind of burned out on Ark, I think. So, uh, yeah, if you enjoyed yourselves, put the word out that I'm going to be playing tomorrow or something. Use social media to my advantage. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. And until next time, take care.